checking and adjusting the plummet of a tribrack in the field without specialized tools. A plummet out of calibration affects the horizontal centering error, which can induce error in the horizontal angles measured with a total station. To check a rotating tribrack, level up a tripod and tribrack and center over a well-defined control point. Focus the plummet reticule to minimize parallax, using white paper under the tribrack if needed, and adjust the focus knob until the reticule is sharp. I find it useful to bob my head up and down, changing the viewing angle of the plummet. If the parallax has been adjusted out, the reticule won't move relative to the control point. Rotate the tribrack 180 degrees and verify the plummet is still centered on the point. If it's not, use the adjustment screws on the side of the plummet to move it halfway back towards the control point. Recenter the tribrack and repeat the process to ensure the adjustment was correct. To check and adjust a non-rotating tribrack, place a piece of paper with an X marked on it on the ground and level up a tripod and tribrack and center them over the X. Trace the the tri-brack head on the foot plate with a pencil. Rotate the tri-brack one third of a revolution, then center it over the tracing on the foot plate that we just made and re-level the tri-brack. Check the plummet. If it's not centered over the original X, the plummet is out of calibration and guide an assistant to mark the new center with an additional X. Repeat this one more time. You now have three X's. Connect those three X's to make a triangle and draw three additional lines from all three points to the midpoint of the opposing side. The intersection of those three lines is the true center of the tribrack. Adjust the plummet using the set screws so that it is now aiming at the center of the triangle. Repeat this process to check that your adjustment was correct.